So what's going on guys welcome back to a new episode so today's video is going to be an information video about offshore fishing with kayak and next to me I have EP this guy has a lot of experience with kayak fish and he's going to um, tell you guys all the things you need to go on offshore fish with kayak so EP thanks for being on this video and giving all the information those guys need about fishing on kayak okay guys this is my kayak this is my first kayak it's an ocean kayak, it's 12.9 feet, um, 34 inch wide and 31 kilo plane, heavy. So um, I customize it, the way I like to rig my kayak is 4 rods, I use 4 rods and um, I use an anchor, I use an anchor and a live bait, this is my live bait. Simple, I drag it behind the kayak because it's cheap and it works, that's important. Everything that works, that's important to me. I have 50 meters of rope. When I go in the shallow and when I go in deeper water, I use on 150 meters. So, and I change um, the anchor. I use another anchor. So this one? Yes. I have two options. To restore all my... Um, my cell phone and all those stuff. See, I secure everything. I put my lures here, just in case if I flip over. My paddle, my jerk. These are my lures when I cast. PFD. I always wear my PFD at this my rope where I secure myself you never know before you know you flip I secure my pebble this is my pedal I store my my gear in here so I have everything that I needed when I throw or deep fish or jig whatever spear ropes This kayak is fast, it depends how much you can tell. This is the hatch, front hatch. Here is the um, life jacket and the battery. I don't have a, a fish finder yet, but I'm gonna get one. <laughs> okay. This is um, my spear. Just in case, some people use a short one. I use the bigger one. You never know. It's balanced. You never know. You never know what you're gonna get out of it. And what else? Rods. I use many rods. I use these for um, trolling. I have light ones for a light tackle. I love light tackle, especially on the jetties. <laughs> and that's my setup. I use bungee. For my rocks, I don't take chances. I don't do crazy things anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it, basically. Okay. So if you can see, guys, you protect most things uh, with uh, sponge. So if something fell in the water, doesn't go in the bottom. And also, all those things are safety. Life jacket. So if you want to go offshore fishing, you have to be safe first. Yes. So. What kind of experience do you have with kayak? Actually, big fish, small fish, what kind of fish do you like to catch on kayak? Most of the time, um, um, jacks. Big jacks and um, GTs and um, kudas. Once, um, uh, most of the time when you use a live bait, um, you get hooked on, on kudas, big kudas. That's why I use this one. See? How do you call it? Uh, we call it a batum. <laughs> Just in case. You hit, yeah, you will hear the fish in the hat. Yeah, yeah. I use a small gap. 
safety. Just my safety plaque. I want them to see me because nowadays there are many crazy people on the water. So, <laughs> I want to see those. Yes. So you want them to see me. And this kind of expanding. I'm going to buy a, um, a pedal. Pedal, pedal one in the future, yes. Because of the wind. Eh? Yeah, it's very island. wind. It's very windy over here. Yes. We struggle with the wind. <laughs> and it's difficult. That's why you have to secure the pedal. Because if you use a pedal, you will drift. Offshore, before you know it. So how went your experience in uh, Florida, your competition that you went? Oh yeah, I went over there just to, um, to look and to learn for the professionals. And did you catch you catch anything over there? No, no. I just went on the pier fishing and um, I, I kayak a little bit, but that's it. That's it. But, um, I got a lot of experience. Nice, and nice. June I'm gonna go back, June and um, August. So but this time you're going to compete? Compete, yes. Nice, nice. Competing is completely different. Uh, so um, that's the plan. Yeah, well, I'm gonna order um, four more kayaks, and I'm gonna have a um, kayak and company. Um. Nice, nice. So this video is more about information, what you have to put on your kayak. But I think when he get when he get all those new kayak, I will join him on the kayak fashion. And of course, it's going to teach me a lot because I have no idea. What to do on kayak? I don't have any experience. Only one time went on kayak, but yeah, yes. it's very close to shore. It's very different than go offshore. So yes, uh, very thanks for all the information about kayak fit, or about your kayak, and hopefully we will go underwater very soon. Very soon, yes. So guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, give this video a like, and if you didn't subscribe yet to my channel, go subscribe to see more about fishing in Aruba. And also, as always guys, expect unexpected, fish on, see you guys next time.